In this video, I will talk about 4th generation Coyote Illuminator Crate Engine. Not forget to subscribe to my channel. Ford has been producing the popular Illuminator small block V8 crate engine series since before the Coyote appeared. And the newest, the 480HP Gen 4, is now available in two new 5.0 liter versions. The flagship crate engine has always been derived from the top power unit under the hood of the Mustang and you'd be right to think most illuminators will be found there. Alternatively, illuminator bodies are also popular with Ford enthusiasts in the custom car and street rod world. Because who really wants to put a Chevy LS in a dual coupe? Like Chevy and Dodge, Ford's crate engines are mostly derived from existing production line power plants, and now that the Mustang is in its fourth iteration with the Coyote DOHC reactor core, that's where the newest pair of Illuminator crate engines come from. While the Illuminator block, cylinder heads, oil pan, and intake manifold are factory parts, Ford performance ensures they remain factory by replacing the hyper-eutectic pistons and centered steel rods with Mayhill forged parts, ARP 2000 rod bolts, and manly forged H-beam rods. Compression ratio of 12 to 1 in naturally aspirated form part number M6007 of 50 NAD, and 9.5 to 1 on the boost ready illuminator case. Part number is M6007 of 50 SED. Note the last SKU digit is a D, indicating the fourth generation Coyote part number. Both the NA and supercharged Gen 4 Illuminator crate engines carry the same MSRP of $15,000, and the vehicle wiring harnesses does not come with exhaust manifolds, PCM, or alternator use kit M8600M50 Balt or M8600M50 Alta for alternator. Both engines are assembled with stock camshafts that have proven their worth, along with the four valves large air moving ports but racers with naturally aspirated competition programs may want to consider an upgrade in this area. The Illuminator Coyote has a solid reputation as a bulletproof performer with its fully forged rotary assembly, and Ford Performance says it's a port of call for all Coyote Mustangs from 2024 and beyond. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel.